here at Homewood Field for the Under Armour All-American High School Weekend. I'm Wayne Viner. That's Bruce Posner. Connor Schellenberger joins us. Bruce, what do you have? Well, it's the first I've seen of the number one recruit in, uh, I hate to use, put that on, on you, but right. you're the number one recruit in the land right now. You know, we've had him here before with Matt Rambo and, you know, we got uh, Epstein on last year. So. Right. And Bubba was pretty high up there. Bubba was like number three or something, yeah, number right. two. So first things first, how about joining a national championship team? How exciting is that for you? It's it's crazy to be honest. Like just watching the game and and seeing the guys celebrate and knowing that you'll be a part of that. It's it's very special and knowing that a lot of those guys come back and they'll have that experience to go to the championship in the final four and hopefully they'll be able to share those experiences with us. I would refer Jack Litch Law Group to anyone that I know because of their professional touch and they get the job done. They get it done timely and they do it right. As you just saw, our clients have trusted us. We need to reward that trust, and we have, with great results and great service. So call the big dogs right now. Don't wait. Find us online at bigdogssmallfirm.com. Yeah, Here, guys. Uh, now, Sorry. I think I read somewhere that you've been kind of like a Virginia guy all along. Yeah. Because you look elsewhere, or you just... Is it in the family, or what made you so high on Virginia? Yeah, so I actually had originally committed here to Hopkins. and then, Oh, boy. Petro's yeah. flipping. All right. All right. Go ahead. Exactly. But, um, you know, just when Coach Tiffany and his staff uh, chose UVA, I had always been going to the game since I was three or four, and just, just feeling like Klockner was the dream for me, and uh, having that opportunity to join UVA and, and hopefully do something special there was uh, something I couldn't turn down. Talk about, talk about how great it is, the, the game that Lars Tiffany plays, the up-and-down high speed. As a uh, as a scorer, as attackman, you gotta love it. Yeah, I love it. It's it's fun to watch. It's fun to play in, especially for attackman. And it's funny because I remember my in high school, I was telling my parents how I wish I could go play at Brown, but I wasn't quite academically there. Right. And then ha it happened out the next year that he was at UVA, and it all worked out. So. I've heard UVA is pretty up there too. I mean, it's it's no small yeah, it's no change, slouch, but, yeah. right? I will tell you one thing. I know that his year at Brown, I think he helped change the game, in that. Uh, bringing long poles into the offense, and uh, he has been a revolutionary guy. Uh, and most of all, what I'm excited about, we, uh, for a matter of fact, we're Maryland guys, and we're really excited about getting a rematch with Virginia next year. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, where is that game? Do you know? Uh, I heard it's at College Park next oh, year. Oh, it's at so. College Park, and I guess the next year it goes back. Yeah, back clock now. Yeah, oh, clock there. So uh, you'll feel some of the revenge factor, mm -hmm. right? Definitely. But that will be the, the game maybe of the year. What was the moment in high school or, or club that you sort of broke out, that you said, hey, I actually am a top flight attack guy? Um, Probably... And probably in eighth grade when just all because the college recruiting was just starting then when the rules were different and mm -hmm. all the colleges it was crazy because my phone i was in eighth grade and then my i was getting emails and text messages from some of the top colleges in the country and then i was like this is kind of real and i actually might have this opportunity to make a dream come true and mm -hmm. that's really when i started to realize that you know maybe i should take this a little bit more serious and go chase my but dreams. the whole way through your attack from being what what year did you start like lacrosse? Yeah, how oh, old were you? I was like three or four. Uh, yeah. There you told go. You. Right. I told you. First grade's too late around here, right. you know. Yeah, you guys may feel old now. Right, right, right. <laughs> hey, listen, we wish you the best of luck, except when you play Maryland. But yeah. uh, you're going to a national championship team. You're in for four great years, I'm sure. And UVA is a wonderful place. So best of luck to you, my yeah, man. Yeah, I appreciate it. All right, Connor. Thanks for being Thank on. You. Thank All you for right. having me.